Hello and welcome to my channel and my new video. And if you are into watch related content, please subscribe. So thank you. Over here we have the Casio Edifice EFV C110. And as the title of the video says, I'm going to show you how to set the time and date on this watch. Well, actually before setting the time and date, I'm going to show you how to switch between um, 12 or 24 hour time format. And that is done whilst in the standard timekeeping mode, simply by pressing this button over here. And as you can see in the lower digital display, it will shuffle between uh, this time setting. And when I press the button, it says A, which indicates that we are in the AM region of the 12 hour time format. When I press this button again, the A will disappear, meaning that we are in the 24 hour time format. But let's get on with setting the time and date. Whilst in the standard timekeeping mode, press and hold the upper left button until you hear the beep. And there it is. Now, first in a row of settings is setting our seconds value. Now, you cannot set the exact value of seconds, but what you can do is reset that value by simply pressing this button over here and it will reset to zero. Once you're done with that, press the mode button once again and you are in the position of setting your daylight saving time mode. As you can see, currently it's flashing off, indicating that the DST is turned off. When I press this button over here, it will shuffle between on or off. So you can turn on your uh, DST by pressing this button over here. I'm going to leave it off because currently in my time zone it's turned off. Next up, press the mode button once again and you are in the position of setting your hour value. Since this is a negative screen display, it's getting hard to pick up the uh, watch info, but I hope you can see it's flashing number three. And that means that we are in the position of setting our hour value. Now it's flashing three, but it's not three o'clock, it's 19 o'clock in my time zone, and I'm gonna press this or this button over here, to increase or decrease the value until I get it to 19. And that is the value of hours in my time zone. Once I'm done with setting my hour value, I'm gonna press the mode button over here and the flashing continues or moves on to the minutes value. As you can see, it's flashing 04. Now, uh, again, the procedure is the same. By pressing this button or this button over here, you can increase or decrease or increase the value of minutes. In my time zone, it is 19 o'clock and 5 minutes. Once done with that, press the mode button once again and you are in the position of setting your year value. As you can see, it's flashing 2022 and it is correct, but pressing this button over here will decrease the value or the lower one will increase the value until you get it to your year value that is correct. Once you're done with setting your year value, press the mode button once again. And as you can see, 11 is flashing. <clears throat> Currently, it's uh, November and it is correct. But you can decrease the value by pressing the upper left button, upper right button, sorry, or the lower right button until you get it to the corresponding number that which corresponds to your month value. Once you're done with that, press the mode button once again, and you are now in the position of setting your day value. Today is November the 1st, but uh, it shows number two, which means that it's wrong. And I will decrease the value simply by pressing the upper right button to, zero, to, sorry, to number one. Again, you can shuffle the value between up or down by pressing one of those two buttons. I'm going to leave it at 1, which is the correct date for my time zone. Press the mode button once again, and we are again back in the position of setting our seconds value. Which means that we have ran through the cycle of setting the time and date. To implement those settings, simply press the adjust button once, and the watch will now uh, implement the settings that we have just ran through. And with that, we have run through the cycle of setting our time and date on the Casio Edifice EFV C110. Thank you very much for watching, and if you are into watch-related content, please subscribe. So thank you.